Keith Appling was back in court this morning, just hours after being released from jail. 7 Action News reporter Shelly Childers was in the courtroom today. Keith Appling is heading back to jail after the judge increases the bond on his first two cases. In court, we spoke with his attorney, who's not happy. I've been in these court halls for 45 years, and I've never seen this done like this before, ever. So this is, this is specialized attention for a specialized person. Otis Culpepper says his client, former MSU basketball star Keith Appling, is being penalized for being a professional athlete. Just hours after he was released from jail on bond for his third criminal charge this year, Appling faced more repercussions. Prosecutors called him back to court on claims he violated bond conditions on his first two cases by continuing to run into the law. So we now have three uh, criminal cases involving firearms occurring in less than four months. And the current bond as set in these cases, uh, people believe is woefully inadequate given this defendant's actions and behavior while on bond. Appling was first arrested May 2nd, charged with carrying a concealed weapon. He made bail and was released. He was arrested again June 18th for similar charges. He made bail a second time and was released. Today, the judge had seen enough, saying Appling was in fact violating the terms of his bond. The bond conditions really aren't that difficult to follow. The judge increased bond on both the May and June cases to $50,000 each. He is allowed to make bail by posting 10%, which comes out to $10,000. The judge also ordered a GPS tether, keeping him at home at night. His attorney also tells us he is expected to make that bail, the $10,000, within a few hours. Reporting in downtown Detroit, Shelley Childers, 7 Action News.